I'm Tony. I'm Rachel. We're going to play a game called Mystic Veil. Vale. This is a deck builder game with a very interesting twist where uh, when, you, when you're building your deck, you actually build the cards within the deck. Mm -hmm. It's kind of cool. It is very cool. This is the first time that we played it. Yeah, this is the first time I've seen it played through other people. Uh, no. That is must have been from the tutorial. I don't want to be a robot. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to be I'm a robot. I'm not a robot. I'm a person, too. I'm a real person. I'm a real person. All right. All right. You will be that one. Okay. That one. The red one. <laughs> the, the red one. The red one with the paw print. Okay. okay your first. My turn. Okay. So I'm already at three decay. Yep. So there's three phases in the game. The first phase is where you draw the cards. That's You're the always going to go up to three decay with it, so they're going to automatically draw the cards up. You can see right here the stats that we have. So she's got three currency to buy with, and you can see the cost right up in here. And then she can push her luck by drawing another card to come out. But if there's a fourth decay, it ends her turn immediately. Mm -hmm. And then uh, so once she's done in this phase, she can go in the next phase, buy a card, and we'll leave it there. And there's also just like cool little animations. It's very the cool. Cards. I love the cards. Yeah, they're they're uh, they have they have cool artwork on them. Okay, they do. I'll go hand it back to you. Okay, alrighty. Well, I am not going to draw another card. I am going to go right into the harvest phase, and I am going to buy myself. Let's see. I think I'm gonna buy some podlings. <laughs> some podlings. I think I'm gonna buy some podlings because. And you can see what she's gonna do now. She's gonna make a card. So that card previously only had that top thing. She slid it down. The physical copy of this is kind of cool because they're, uh, uh, what was it called, lithographic or something like that. Oh the, yeah, the clear. Yeah, the clear kind of cards. And then you put they're in sleeves, and the game comes with the game sleeves. And you slide the cards together inside the sleeves. I think that's really cool. It's really cool, but I can also see where it's an absolute pain in some ways. <laughs> so in the digital copy of this, you don't actually have to like unsleeve things and all that kind of stuff. So this is much better. Sometimes the digital is a little bit better, but it is a very cool idea. Yes, there there is reasons for me that uh, I would prefer that. Hmm. I think I want this one, actually. Okay, you gotta go to the harvest phase. Yes, I do, don't I? You do, unless you want to draw another card. Nope, I got three, I'm good. And then, uh... I'm gonna put that one... ...with this one. You've got a Peacekeeper Druid. I do. And I got one point left, but that doesn't have anything that's one point. <laughs> Correct. So, I'm gonna, so the other thing is like you can see this little symbol down here, the green square. So these ones up here, there's tier two and tier or tier one and tier two. Can't remember what the tiers. Probably tier one and tier two, I think is the names. Um, of these cards right here that you end up getting, and they cost what you see here. And this one's worth two points, and the little shields are where you actually see your points coming from. Mm -hmm. So I got or no, you got one point. I Yes, I did. I didn't even notice my card I got had one point on it. Yep, so it's like this one has two points over here. So um, when you get these, they have points on them and they have some benefits sometimes. Yep, they're kind of like passive. Yes, passive and buff cards. They go sort of down here. They're like persistently there. Yes. All right, and I'm going to move on. All right. It's me. You're a blended threats. Uh, one uh, function i function i <laughs> <laughs> function parameter i all right i huh these are some very interesting ones this symbol will negate one of the decay symbols but it takes one mana away i've only got two so i think i'm gonna go for a fertile soil and i think i'm gonna get this that gives me another mana. Eh, and that's it. If you're not familiar with deck building, uh, what you do is you constantly are getting cards and building them. And then once you've gone through all your cards, 
what you'll do is you'll take the cards that are over here in your discard pile, pile reshuffle them, and then they'll end up being what you draw from again. So you're constantly making cards. You're building your deck. Mm -hmm. And this one's cool because not only are you building your deck, you're building the cards in the deck mm -hmm. rather than just taking whatever cards out there and shuffling it in like in Ascension. I think that's a really cool aspect. Ascension's also an awesome game. It is also an awesome game. This one is equally just as awesome. Other advancements added to this card cost two less. Yeah, I guess I'll... Not a whole lot of options there. I can always get a, a fertile soil, but... Mm -hmm. I think I'm going to... So I got two. Yeah, I'm gonna... Uh, uh, that's all kind, kinds of a gamble. I guess it's all the same, isn't it? Hmm. When played, you may discard any other card in your field. That's a bit weird. Hmm. Well, I got two mana again. Let's see. You can push your luck. I could. So if you push your luck and you draw a fourth uh, decay, which are those red symbols... You, you turn it immediately. Yes. I don't think I'm going to push it. I'm risk averse. Yeah, you push it. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'm going to get... Um, that one's not ideal. We'll do this one. That nice calming music. It does. I like it. That's a lot of cards. That's what I like to see. I have three. So if you see there are blank cards, this is just so that you can build it. Mm hmm I still only really have that. I am actually going to build... Oh, I That's have, it. Yep, I was thinking I had four for some reason. Hmm. All right. Uh, okay. Ooh, I have four this turn. Okay, I am definitely not going to push my luck. I'm going to go like this. That's very interesting. I think I'm gonna go for. Oh, it's got a decay on it. Mm -hmm. Decay, decay. <laughs> I'm gonna go for the hawk because that's just super cool. There was a uh, a song from Sid the Science Kid about <laughs> decay. And every time I, I see it, that. yeah, I remember that song. I was trying to figure out where that was from because I remembered that. That's right. It was Sid the Science Kid soundtrack. Mm -hmm. Push my luck here. Uh, just do, um. I'm gonna get some uh, fertile soil for your veil. Yep. Okay. Need to fertilize some of that soil. That decay's got. gotta be used for something. Yes. Okay, so let's see. Lifebringer seed is nice. Oh, you got five points. I do. That cancels all. Hmm. Gain one crystal, one victory point for each. Oh, I see. Okay. 
for every one of the blue masks on the card. I got it. Okay, I was trying to figure out what that meant. I see. I think I'm going to go this whoa with this one maybe and I'm gonna cancel out that and in my turn I've got four this time well in your field you have one loss oh, that, but that cancels a decay um Someone that costs two less. That's interesting. I wonder how that works. I don't know, but I'm going to push my luck. Ooh. I want this one. That's five. Mm -hmm. Okay. I would really... You have to go to yeah, the... Yeah, I do, don't I? <laughs> you do. <laughs> like, I'm really trying to get that card. I'm real... You were trying real hard. Yes, I was. And a rhino came out. Huh, yeah, that's pretty cool. It's got a lot of uh, symbols on it. It also has a like, decay. 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 <laughs> <laughs> it's so stuck. Uh, There's still cards you can purchase. There? What can Where? I purchase? Fertile soil? It must have something that reduces costs, because that's too. Uh, oh, advancements to that card cost two less. Where do you see that at? It's whatever that. Whichever one you had, um, the one on the right, I believe, the Druidic Chant. Other advancements added to this card cost two less. So you could put a Fertile Soil on top of that for free. Oh, yeah, I w sure. Or do I want to save it? Hmm. Nope, I am actually not going to. Okay. Save it for something better kind of thing? Yep. Ready. Two mana. That is not super great. Super cool. Not super, great. super cool. I'm gonna just go ahead and get a fertilized soil. Fertilized soil. Yep. And we'll just call it good right there. I am at two as well. I could go to four. But I don't care to. Let's go here. I'm actually going to get this one. Mm, okay. Your turn. My turn. Turn seven, actually. <laughs> it says the turn number up there. It does. Just notice that. What does this do again? Gives you a turn. <laughs> Oh, okay. That's just a first land. Yeah, you have okay. two blues and a uh, decay. I'm going to push. No! And that's what happens when you push luck. No! And you go over. Darn. Okay. That ended my turn. A three. Yeah, actually. That one's quite nice. Mm-hmm. I'll put that one there. Alright. Podling. Let's see. There is a podling. Another podling. All right, so I have... Look, uh, they look a little evil, actually. They might be. Maybe they're just really misunderstood. <laughs> or maybe they are evil. Who knows? Yeah. Okay, so I have... Well, I, guess, I think they know. I don't know. Do you think evil people know they're evil? Probably. No, they probably think they're doing things for the right reasons. Yeah, that's the old uh, adage. 
I have a Veil card. And then I'm going to get... What do you have two of that's a square? Two of that's a square? Go Where? right up on the mouse. The right. Oh, uh, my victory points? I think? No. It's not a spendable currency. It's coming from this card here. I am not entirely certain, to be honest. I want you. Come with me, Podling. Oh, oh, <laughs> I choose you, Podling. <laughs> and... I don't know what that is. If you highlight. Oh over... yeah, that's those are the points that take tick down to the end of the game. Oh okay. So there's like current points, and then there's end of the game points, which are the gray. Yeah, these two added together give you your points. Yes. But the. Um, the the yeah these are like ticked up and this is what you get from cards I understand though yeah I have five you could get a rhino I could get a rhino I'm gonna get a rhino what are you again hmm. oh it's in the center I could get this you could that's two mono one played you may discard any other card in your field interesting I wonder why you would do that I guess you could discard one with um, decay on it yeah and then that could open up for you to draw more yeah that's why true why can I not get this one because it's worth six and you only have five yeah but oh but it, it doesn't a, go into that card. slot yeah. yep that one's eight search your deck for any card you may put it into the discard pile well then. Interesting. Hmm. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I'm going for this one. Okay. That one's pretty cool. Yeah. That's a lot of points, too. I think it says a three, but it's hard to read. Yeah, it's three points, one decay, one yellow. Okay. I'll put that one on. This one. Okay. And then you could get a Fertile Soil for free. I'm guessing from one of your other cards. Yeah, from that card. From this one right here, yeah. I think I will. That'd be one. Has to go on that one though. Um. Yeah, I'll take it. Okay. It's free real estate. Yeah, we got an achievement called <laughs> "It's Free Real Estate." <laughs> that's that's funny. All right, I have four of the manas. I am going to get... That wolf is pretty cool. It's a... Yeah, I think I'm Mystic getting wolf. wolf. It is, it's very cool. There you go, coming with me, wolf. Oh, there's a plow. It's one point, one of that, and a green. Do I have three? You do. If I push my luck, I could have two, three, four. That's a lot. Yeah, That's a lot of money. Have two. Oh, oh okay. you're so lucky you did it. Seven. Yeah. Wow. Why is that one worth seven? I'm not sure. It doesn't look all that great. Oh, ha. I could uh, spoil. Anyways, I had a safety. Oh, you did. Oh, that's nice. I guess I didn't read that the first time. That's a decay of points. I don't have any empty ones. I guess I can do this. This thing should work now, right? Um, well, it didn't end your turn. Activate. There we go. Nice. What's this one? This is too less on anything. It's on a top slot. I think we'll get this one starting out. Okay. Five, six, seven.
I'll put that. I need to move forward. That's right. I keep forgetting to move to the next phase. <laughs> I'm ready to go to the next phase. I just not clicking the button. That removes. That reduces the points also. Put this on here. I could put a fertile soil on this one. Mm-hmm. And I obviously can't go up there. Hmm. Um, what are you thinking? I'm trying to figure out. It's not too bad. Not too bad. It doesn't give you any immediate benefit. It's more of like a long-term thing. I don't think I want it though. I think I'm gonna skip. Okay. Or do I want to go ahead and throw? No, I don't. It doesn't give me. Uh, I don't know. Uh, indecision. I'm gonna just skip. Yeah, in turn. All right. There's a deck builder I played a long time ago that if you didn't get a card, you could choose a card to get rid of instead. Oh, I that's that was interesting. A good idea. Yeah. So if you were, if the deck was, or if the display was in such a way that nobody wanted something that was out, instead of just going back and forth and somebody having to take it, it uh, if it left the capability to avoid that. Hmm. That's nice. I think more games should have that. Really. Mm-hmm. Oh, really? With two? I'm just going to push my luck, actually. Hmm. Three. Yep. Go with that one. Interesting and, uh, one. In there. All right. Needs me. All right. We have two, but. I'm gonna get this guy. Where can you get that one? Because I have two of the yellows. Oh, okay. Right yeah. There. I was thinking he had two of the greens for some reason. Ah. And then... What will we do? We will throw... Maybe. I'm having a hard time with this mouse. It's not cooperating. I'm going to just put a fertile soil. Ooh, you got six. Oh, I do? Mm-hmm. I have two green. Maybe that's what I was saying. You do. There's nothing up there with two green. Yeah, it's unfortunate. I have five right now. We get this one. You should go to the next phase so you can see what you can get. Well, I, I, if I go to the next phase, I can't. You can't draw anymore. Yes. True. I'm trying to decide if I want to, because I got. One, two, three, four. You go up to nine. I think I'm just going to stick with the five. Oh, I had that card out. Crap. Oh, yeah, you could have drawn again. Yep.
Okay, I can't do anything with those two greens up here. Nope, not yet. Alright. I am not gonna push anything. I'm gonna go straight to the next phase. That one's quite nice. The bear. The bear. It's a bear totem. It is. I wonder who braided the bear's hair. Well, somebody very brave. <laughs> very brave. Somebody very brave braids the bear's hair. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's a Say that five times fast. Yeah. Someone very very. <laughs> someone very brave braided the bear's hair. I like it. Barely say that one time slow. You barely say it one time slow. No. So he's pretty nifty. Yeah, he is. He's a nifty wolf. He is pretty nifty, I have to say. Oh, a nifty wolf. Come to my hand. <laughs> <laughs> Come with me. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Ooh, I did not get many points on that one. Get three, but I'm in a good spot. I'm gonna get this guy. Yep, yeah, that's unfortunate. And then hmm. I think I'm just going to go with the fertile soil. Sure. Let's see, you're at 16, I'm at 7. You're 9 points ahead right now. Oh man, I'm going to have to push my luck, so this is not good. Nice. That's 3. get this one. Nice, that's a good one. Mm-hmm. I can't get any Veil cards, though. It's... The time I have actually had set up, it's just been the wrong combo. Nice, you get one uh, thing every time. Mm hmm. Hmm. Interesting. Grove Tender. What is that symbol? Oh, it's another one of the. Yeah, it's just one of those. Um, yeah, it's a purple swirl, whatever that is. Yeah. I don't see any up there, but... Yeah. And then... We'll go with... That. Every time we get a car, there's like birds that chirp in the background and stuff. <laughs> I know! I love the sounds in this. Mm -hmm. It's very chill. Yeah, it's well developed. I like the the way it is. Yeah, plus the card animations, like it's it is really well developed.
Oh, you can buy a card this turn. Hmm? You can buy a veil this turn. Yeah, I can. <laughs> you have options. What are these? I still don't know what those are. Those are going to take out of the pool of victory points on this turn at the end of your turn. Ah, uh, yes, yes. Okay. I'm going to get two points. Yes. Points from that. And where's the other points coming from? You have one point. On one that. here. Oh, and one right there. One right there. And then I get one for this one, too. Yes. The bees. Not the bees. <laughs> that I think bottom for nine. Uh, that's not gonna work. Right, let's go ahead and move on. I want one of those. Oh, you should have got the other one. Got that one. Not worth any points. Oh, I need points. Oh, yep. That's true. That's a good point. <laughs> no, it's a bad point. <laughs> it doesn't have any points. That's fair. That's fair. I need points at this point. At this point, <laughs> at this point in time, What's I need your points. point? My point is I need points. <laughs> Ooh, that is actually quite nice. Yeah, you've got the one card with the guardian yeah. there. But I only get one for that. Yeah, you almost want to build that. Hmm. Okay, I think I'm going to go with an owl. This one. Yep. Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> it made an owl sound. Yes, it did. I love it. I still have two, but... I will go ahead and throw a fertile soil. You're going to throw some fertile soil? I'm going to throw some fertile soil <laughs> at something. Stand back. I'm throwing <laughs> fertile soil. Um, you are vacuuming it up afterwards, I'm assuming? No. No? No. Why do you think I'm throwing it? <laughs> it should be there. It's, fertile soil belongs on the carpet. <laughs> apparently. I have dub bears. Oh, hey, I'm getting the world tree. Okay, I'm getting the world tree. Yggdrasil? I'm good. Yggdrasil. So there's three phases in a turn, and I can't remember what the first one is, but the harvest phase is the second one where we actually perform our actions. So when you see cards like, like say, harvest gain, when it says harvest, that's when you get the benefit of that card. Mm -hmm. I'm explaining for the people yes. listening. That is a good idea. All right. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I was like, where's my mouse go? I totally bumped the mouse on accident. That one's pretty nice. Um, but... Wouldn't it be... It would. If you had a hawking thorn hide. guardian <laughs> on the card. So I don't have anything out right now that has guardians, but... Hmm. do have eight right now. I should probably do this. Yeah, yep, that's what we're gonna do. We're getting the bees. The bees! Not the bees. Not the bees! Yes, the bees, actually. I have a really crappy hand right now. What's this? Oh, I can't use that anymore. And the green. Not combo with anything. I think I'm literally just gonna have to go with this crappy hand. Fertile soil time. Yep. Run some more. I'm fertilizing some soil again. All over the carpet. <laughs> so messy. So messy. I'm getting the vacuum. You're getting the vacuum? I'm going so to have to. If you're, not <laughs> vacuum, if you're not vacuuming it up, I'm going to have to get the vacuum. Mm. Let's me.
I don't like any of those very well. I think I'm just gonna go for the fertile soil. I don't huh? like you guys. Yep, we're just gonna do this. And... That. Oh great, now we're all out of fertile soil. All gone. Every bit of it. He threw it all on the floor. <laughs> we got a pile of soil on the floor. Pile yeah. of soil. It's hard to say. Pile of soil? Pile of soil. Pile of, pile of soil. <laughs> I've got a pile of soil. Sounds like a type of dinosaur. Oh, it does, yeah. Pile, pile. pile of soil a sore. Yeah. Hey, right. what is it? You here and a reduced cost. You got two of those. You got an army of those now. What? Those rhinoceros things? I've only got one. I thought you had another one, too. No, I didn't get another one yet. Oh, okay. Okay, you don't have an army yet. I got an army of one. You have an army of one. One of those could be an army. Those things are terrifying. Oh. Is this you or me? Should be... Du -du -du. When this comes out, you may discard a card. I think it's me. I think it is you. I got that card, I don't, right? Yeah, I, I don't think I got that. Okay. I'll discard this one. Oh, that's for your next hand. Yep. Ooh, nice. I didn't even see the rest of it, so... Yeah. Because... <laughs> because, yeah. Because reasons. Oh, no. Coming with me, ley lines. And then what have we got here? I think I'm gonna scroll and not grab because that's get just... a snack. I'm gonna get a snack. He's coming with me. Your soul is mine. <laughs> is that what snakes say? No, that's what you're. You're taking the snake. Yeah, yeah. He's gonna help my my veil, my garden. Apparently. What else do I have out here? Nope. I got seven. Rude song. Yeah. For you. Oh, I'm afraid to push it again. You do have the card out that will let you negate it, though. So it says, on this turn, if you were to spoil, you may discard the card on the top deck instead. Oh. Um, which will discard the card, but what I'm wondering is if it discards and then the next one's a spoil, do I still spoil? And I don't want to find out right now. <laughs> That's fair. <laughs> so I, go I don't blame you. I can't get this one. I don't really have a, another one I could get. His hand is on fire. He should probably look into that. Seems okay with it. He does. Not too bothered. I would be bothered by that. I'd probably be bothered too. Him? Not so much. Not so much. He's, He's totally okay. chill. Yeah. yeah. Do not have any of the helmets. Um... Throw this one in here. All right. I 
don't want either one of those, I guess. I guess... Nah, I don't want those. Great, I'm gonna get a fertile soil. Okay. Are we almost out? There's only two of them out here. There are. We are almost out of those one tier, tier one cards or whatever. Come with me. There we go. Nope, that one just refreshed. Okay. Oh, that's weird. Hm. I wonder what the two is then. Maybe they just, um... Reduce. Uh, is this me again? Yes, you may discard a card. Oh, that card's coming back out again already? I guess so. Is you shuffled. Nothing? Yeah. Um... I'm fine with any of these coming out, actually. Hmm. You're gonna beat me because of Veil cards? Yeah, I've been able to get a lot of Veil cards, luckily. I don't have a lot of those. And then we'll do... Wolfie. Wolfie. Wolfie's coming with me. Wow. Wow, that was a lot of cards. Yeah. I didn't even see what all that was. You end up with nine. Oh, well, you have nine. Mm-hmm. Well, so did you. Oh, so did I. Mm-hmm. last turn. I'm going to get the four points, so it's going to put oh, that. Yep, you're right. So, I guess, um, okay. How much is that worth? Two. This card is worth one victory yeah. point at the end of the game for each symbol on this card. Each, oh. any symbol on that card. That's interesting. For two... That's worth two times. Right. So it's not worth two, it's only worth two times. It's nine. One. It's a bottom row, I can put it on that one. I'll get two for that one, but this one... Were two as well. Mm -hmm. That one does not have any symbols. I'm going to actually make it more. So I don't actually gain the benefit of that card for that turn. Right. It's stacked. Okay. You got a deer. That's interesting. Yeah, it's not worth any points though. Nothing up here is worth points. See, that's one of the big things is like you got a lot of veil cards mm -hmm, with points on them. You have yes. 23 points there. So that's that's actually a big deal. Literally none of the ones I can get have points on them. Alright, um, I'm just gonna put this one down here, I guess. Look to spirit token. Oh, you can choose one or the other because it's a, uh, wild. Oh, I see it down here. Yep, so you just choose which one you want to give towards it. Okay, I guess it doesn't really matter. That should be everything I can do. Let's see. Final turn complete. That is the end. Oh! Ooh, that was much closer than I thought it was. Three points! Is there like a recap? Uh, it shows your deck, I guess. 
There's not like a. Oh, there's your veil cards. Yep. I could have just gotten a point from that veil card that I yeah. just got. Yeah, then you would have actually gotten closer. That was really close. Yeah. And then, uh, here, let's see. And yours. Yeah, because your veil cards, you have two, three, oh, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. You have 11 points in your veil cards. Yeah, I, actually, I think if you go back to the other screen, it shows you the points. The two and the one. I don't know. Never mind. I don't know what that means. I thought that was showing the points, but it's not. No, that's where that's where I was saying. Is there a recap? I don't think there mm -hmm. is. But this is where you got two, three, uh, six, eight, ten, eleven. Yeah. And I, I just, I didn't have the right setup or timing for those. Yeah, that was interesting. Actually, that was that was pretty fun. Yeah, I like this game quite a bit. It's actually got a good design to it. Um, obviously, like. Uh, it's one of those, like, most of the games of this type, you're going to have to learn the strategy that you prefer mm -hmm. over time. But yeah, that is, see, it said 18 turns. 18 so that turns. gives a sense. It was about 45-ish minutes. Okay. Uh, that's for first time playing, so I imagine in the future that'll go faster. And then if we put out, what's it going to do? We'll go back to the main screen. <laughs> All right, that is Mystic Veil. Vale. We'll see everybody again next time. Bye.